Previously on Alan Wake, under the influence of the Dark Presence, I wrote a horror story that is coming true. Jagger had been my editor, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. Some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story. Together we can create something absolutely wonderful. The Lagan. It does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. My mom gave me this old light switch. The clicker. Alice is being kept in a dark prison. I need to find Cynthia Weaver to fix this. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. What's up, boys? Welcome back to the channel. expecting a record crowd from the neighboring counties. Naturally, we hope to break the record set by last year's Moose Fest in our neighboring town, Walkery. Ladies and gentlemen, some people have asked me, what's the big deal about Deer Fest? And I think that this sums it up. It's about friendship and community. We've got a great party coming up, though. Uh, let's try to hold it in until tomorrow and get through the night in one piece, all right? Someone will come for it when the time is right. Thomas said so. He wrote it. The key is insurance. It's my job to keep it safe. Safe in the light. Mm. Always in the light. Hello. Hello. All the manuscript pages were gone. The FBI agent had taken them. I think... I think my tongue just took a crap in my mouth. Ugh. Oh, wait, we're in jail now? Oh, Al. Al, this is not good. That about sums it up. Oh, no, poor Barry. Oh, oh I am never drinking again. Oh, don't lie to yourself. I need to talk to Weaver. She's the one in the song, the Lady of the Light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, Al, kind of but we're stuck here. That, They're not yeah, gonna... Interviewed Wake. I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell you, it was an interesting read. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out of here. You hear me in there, Brett Easton Ellis? Huh? Agent Nightingale, I want to talk to your superior. Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <sighs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I... Oh, shit. <sighs> Wake, what's wrong? Lady, are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm gonna trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Whoa! Get... Get back in the cell, Stephen King. The only way you're leaving this place is over my dead... Wait a minute. I know this... Oh, no! Oh, I mean, the guy was a dick, but he didn't deserve that. God. Light. We need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Oh, man. We're sitting ducks with... Nightingale tried to make sense of the manuscript. It was disjointed and strange. He didn't understand half of it. But it all rang true. Impossibly true. He took out his hip flask when he reached the page that described how he reached the page that made him take out his hip flask. It wasn't the booze that made his mind reel. Lights out. Stay cool. I can get the emergency. Nightingale felt the situation veering out of his control, but the gun at least felt steady in his hands. He was ready to fire, resolved that he would let this happen over his dead body. And yet he hesitated. He had seen this moment before, read it in the page. He was transfixed by the deja vu and the horror that he was a character in a story someone had written. Then the monstrous presence burst in behind him and dragged him into the night. Oh, man. Poor bastard. I mean, honestly, like, he didn't deserve to die, but the guy was a dick. Damn it, Barry. Get your, move your butt. I saw something. It's like I knew I saw something over here. Oh, another flare. Okay. Another thermos? Wait, was Barry? 
Oh. Oh, wow. Okay. That's, that's not good. Come on. Come on, Breaker. Here are your things. Wake, what do I need to know? What do you need from me? They can be hurt in the light, only in the light. And I need to find Cynthia Weaver. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommissioned power plant. I can get you there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on. Let's get back to your friend. In a rescue chopper? Wheeler, I need you to stay here. What? No. We're going to fetch our ride, but I have friends who need to be warned about this, and I can't be in two places at once. I need your help. Well, okay. Here's a <laughs> list of people and phone numbers. I need you to call them and tell them you have a message from me. Night Springs, okay? They'll know what to do. Night Springs? Like the TV show? Gotcha. Oh, hey, that radio guy is on the list, Maine. Who's Frank Breaker? He related to you? My dad. Hey, is this like a secret society? Can you do this? <laughs> You'll be safe here. The backup power's on. These guys need to be alerted, just in case we don't come back. Uh, you'll come back for me, though, right? As soon as we get the chopper ready. Thanks, Wheeler. I owe you one. Okay, let's go, Wake. Through the back. My hangover wants a pizza. You think there's any way I could order one, Al? <laughs> <laughs> Fat chance of that, buddy. control box from here. We need to get to the other side over the rooftop. I'll go. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, okay? Find a way to access the roof. Uh -huh. Oh, come on. Come, come on. Okay. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's go. Damn birds. Oh, wait. I see you, flares. Come here. Come to daddy. I'm not taking a chance with this one. Okay. Just in case. It was a little closer to the ladder than I like. <laughs> Never this weird, though. We need to bypass the damaged control box. What am I, an electrician? Hold on. Okay. Oh, ow, damn. Ow. That's smart. Good job, Wake. Okay, stick close. Our first stop is the town hall. The keys to the chopper are there. Where'd she go? Alright.
Oh, damn it. I wasn't paying attention. Got him. Okay. Come on, breaker. Oh, great. Okay, okay. Oh, let's go, Sheriff. This is freaking crazy. Oh, the diner. I still feel so bad for Rose. Poor thing. Good job. I decided to save ammo and not shoot at him. What's that? Follow? Huh. Follow? Why does it want me to follow? Oh, jeez. Got him. And I thought New Yorkers were rude. That's a bunch of porta potties. Okay, okay. Let's get the hell out of here. Dude, okay, this is getting crazy. Like, this freaking darkness is getting so freaking strong. I mean, it's gotten to the point where now I'm, like, I'm involving normal citizens. Wait, over here! There's light! I have a key. Watch my back, Wait. Oh. It's an ambush. Cool, cool, cool. Got this, Sarah. Come on. I believe in you. I believe in you, Sarah. Take him out. Take him out. You can do it. Nice. Oh. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, I'm following you, sweetheart. Get the hell out. Oh, thermos. Oh, is that a flare? Flares. 
have one shotgun shell left. Okay, someone's messed with the fuse box here, but you should be able to jury rig it while I find the keys. I already got electrocuted once today. How about I look for the keys and you get burned for a change? Fine. <laughs> they should be in the clerk's office on the other side of the building near the main entrance. Dark person sucked back. Before, Barbara Jagger's face was furious. The story in the manuscript had been making it stronger all the time, but now the light had set the writer free and hurt it, weakened it. It was only a matter of days before the dark presence would be strong again. But meanwhile, it would be difficult to recapture the writer. Nice. The message was from Barry. He was getting worried at the station. He wanted us to hurry. In case, okay. Oh, might as well. I'm out of shotgun ammo, anyways. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Oh, I went into the wrong office by accident. It's this one. I actually didn't mean to do that. Ooh. Yoink. Okay, Sheriff. I got the keys. Nice. Oh, no. Barry? Why isn't he inside? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 Barry, run. Run, Barry. Barry, look out! Barry, move! Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ. Barry! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. Yeah, but he's still cut off from us. All right, boys. I mean, that's where I'm going to go and end it for tonight. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.